Alright guys, here we go. Welcome back to another video of Hitman 3. Um, so how you guys been? Um, hope you guys been doing good. You know, just as usual. So here we're just gonna start with a new game of the first game of the year. Hitman 3. Hope you guys enjoy it and hope you guys like it as well guys. Um, hopefully it's a good game. Depends. I may finish it, I may not, depending how hard is it. I know I'm not super good with like Handmans, I play one and two, and then I never finished it because I couldn't do it. Like, to be honest, I couldn't do it. So let's see how this one is. I hope this one's easier. <laughs> but let's see. Um, so first one of the year, guys, and many more to come because I do have a playlist. Um, I do want to play them all through the year, and at the end of the year, see which one I like more. Just do like a rundown every single game and see. I can decide which one I like more, which one not. Um, I hope you guys enjoy it. I hope you guys like it. Um, just make sure to hit your like down below and subscribe as well, guys, to support the channel. And just leave your New Year's resolution, guys. Mine is to make more games and try to stay active and don't quit like making video, guys. I actually want to stay here, keep making videos, and keep keep making you guys like those. So for that to happen, guys, I need you guys' help. So make sure to subscribe and hit the like button, guys. So let's get back into the video, guys. Titles are Hemen three. Let's go, guys. Let's get this started. Agent forty seven and Diana Burnwood are the world's top assassins working for the ICA. Unknowingly, they have been hired by a shadow client to target a number of operatives of Providence, a secret organization working in the highest echelons of power. Providence's controller, the Constant, approaches Diana and makes her a deal. Eliminate the Shadow Client and learn about 47's past. But when 47 discovers that the Shadow Client is Lucas Gray, his lost childhood friend, he and Diana switch sides to fulfill an old pact. Destroy Providence. Together, they manage to capture the Constant forcing him to reveal the identities of the three Providence partners. Eliminate them, and the war would be over. However, the Constant has an ace up his sleeve. Look closer. In the shadows. Behind the everyday world. Beyond the headlines and the seats of power, a hidden hand. A kind of company known as Providence. To it, we were just assets to use and throw away, to do the unthinkable the unforgivable, and it never gave us a second thought, until now. After decades in the shadows, we are fighting back, me and 47. Much has been lost, but we are closer than ever. We trapped the Constant, Providence's chief controller and finally learnt the names of its three partners. In their downfall, we lay the past to rest. And, just maybe, look towards the future. 37. It's time.
partners are down there. You know, I never planned this far ahead. You never do. I see someone got his memory back. Wait, is that a beacon? What the hell? Base. Alexa Carlisle's helicopter just took off. Confirm target locations, over. Diana, what's the status? Right. We have a situation. Carlisle has left the building. And I think I know why. The Constant has escaped. He persuaded one of the sailors into setting him free. And since then, he's been seizing control of Providence assets and resources. I can only assume Carlisle is rushing to contain the damage. If she slips away again... We'll keep track of her. Make sure she doesn't. Meanwhile, the plan stays the same. Your destination is the Scepter, the world's tallest building where the partners are laying low, courtesy of their host, Sheikh Omar al-Ghazali. Marcus Stuyvesant is fifth generation old money. His family made its fortune in real estate and banking and were at one point the chief landowners in New York. Carl Ingram is a powerful Washington kingmaker whose family grew rich selling gunpowder during the American Civil War and later established a globe-spanning empire in oil, coal, and steel. Both families long since retreated from public view, but their quiet dominance endures to this day. Now, the partners likely suspect that we're coming, so Mr. Gray will infiltrate building controls and disable all electronic doors and elevators. Stuyvesant and Ingram are about to find they have nowhere left to run. Right. This is our moment, 47. Providence ruined our lives with the flick of a pen. Today, we return the favor. Happy hunting. Welcome to Dubai, 47. Today is the inauguration of the Scepter, and the ceremony is well underway. You will find Marcus Stuyvesant near the building's signature art installation. While a paranoid Carl Ingram has ensconced himself in his penthouse suite, security on highest alert. Mr. Gray is already in position and ready to assist. Good luck, 47. All right, guys, here we go. 47, come in. 47, do you copy? I'm here. Are you in position? I'm heading towards the point of entry. Good. Get back to me when you're there. Look at that view, guys. Damn, I just want to jump skydive, guys. It's so tall. Oof. I'm scared of high, bro. I wouldn't be even standing here if I wasn't. All right, let's go. Drop down. So, guys, I'm playing on PC this time. So, here with me and the controllers. X. Damn, look at that view. Look at that. The sh oh my god, like, this kid looks beautiful. Like, it took time making this. Forty-seven, use your camera and scan the lock, will you? I think I can override the window's controls from here. All right, I'll get a camera out. Uh, press side to inventory. Oh, here it is, camera. I'm in position. Forty-seven, the inaugural is taking place close by. Once you've infiltrated it, get your bearings. I'm sure there must be floor plans somewhere. Understood. We need absolute focus on this one. If Ingram and Stuyvesant are alerted to our presence, we may lose them for good. We are so close, 47. Don't worry. They're not going anywhere. Right. 
Oh, that was so cool. <laughs> let's go. Alright, let's see who we have to kill. On behalf of his Royal That's Highness there. Omar Al Ghazali, um, I bid you welcome to the center. So I heard you can use objects in this game to like kill people too, so the other one must be somewhere else, because there's one there. Welcome! Oh, he didn't say nothing. Hello! Good to see you. How lovely to see so many Good. I'm very excited. Familiar faces here today. This has been a dream of mine for a great many years. And as all of you know, I am from one of the less privileged sides of the respectful Al Ghazali family. But with a small loan from my father, I soon built up a construction empire that was worthy of the great Al Ghazali legacy. So, I would like to thank my cousins without the other one is. friendship and influence. This achievement might not have been possible. Thank you. I'm proud to yet again immortalize our great family. by the Royal Highness Omar Al Ghazali. I should have clearance. The name is Zayna Kazi. Sir, I understand. You can't enter without being searched. It's standard procedure. This is ridiculous. Well, that's how it is. Think about it and come back if you want. I'll be waiting upstairs in the reception. Zana Kazim, AKA the Vulture. One of the top agents working for Crystal Dawn, the Pan-African terrorist organization. I almost hired him myself once, but chose the Maelstrom instead. Now, what is his business here? Hmm. Alright, let's keep going. Crystal. Discuss yourself, Sana. Okay, so you have to discuss yourself with him. Alright. Who's this? Alright, don't mind me. Dr. Pop. I was this. Inter oh, we can interact with the terminal. Listen, I want to talk to the partners directly. Make them understand why all of this is happening. And that terminal gives me an idea. There's a server room near the Sheikh's personal reception. If you can gain access to it, we might be able to recover useful intel from it. We'll have to work together to hack the system, but it's our best shot. How was this? How to mighty for um, listen and talk to partners directly to make them understand why all this happened? It looks like the staff area could provide you with a viable route to oh. the server room. What is your problem? <coughs> you are sick. You have no idea. What is this? Sound system. What do I do? Yes, you are the man. Yeah. Sorry, man, but you're just making me feel a little... That's gonna hurt! Guards, over here. I need some assistance. Hey, hey, hey. Just hold out. Oh, I've never seen anything like this. You gotta do something. Hey, what? Someone's in a world of pain. I heard it just now. I'll look into it. I need to know the control of this game. I need you to keep your head down if you want to Don't me. tell me you don't know what went down here. I'm talking to you, hey, sir. Hey, get up. You won't give me no choice, buddy. I will be forced to take action. Last chance. Oh, stop! Come on! 
shooting that person right now. Positive ID on our guy. <gasps> Jesus! That's right. No sudden movements, mister. He's engaged in hand-to-hand -hand combat. What? Save the game a lot because of this. Caught Ingram and. Let me see the controllers first because. Okay. Um, mouse and keyboard. Key bindings. Move forward, move left. Pick up space, cover, track body. Oh, mallet Q. Use my um, take this. Okay. Um, surrender. You just punch him in the face with the can. That's what I did. Listen. I want to talk to the partners directly. Make them understand why all of this is happening. And that terminal gives me an idea. And there's a server room near the Sheikh's personal reception. If you can gain access to it, we might be able to recover useful intel from it. You'll have to work together to hack the system, but it's our best shot. Ah, wrong one. There's a girl there, bro. Just Me. asking nicely. No, you were being a bitch. Now go away and binge eat some celery or whatever it gets like. No. You've got to be kidding me. He was gonna lead them to that. Oh my god. Thanks for your help. I'll report your information. That's the guy right there! Oh my god. Stop. You don't stop, there'll be Bro, what the heck? Why can't I do this? I told you guys I was bad on this. Oh Listen, I want to talk to the partners directly, make them understand why all of this is happening. And that terminal gives me an idea. There's a server room near the Sheikh's personal reception. If you can gain access to it, we might be able to recover useful intel from it. We'll have to work together to hack the system, but it's our best shot. It looks like the staff area could provide you with a viable route to the server room. Bitch, now go away and binge eat some celery or whatever it gives like you do. Or do something worse than like cancer in your face. Oh my god, what is your problem? <coughs> you are sick. No idea. Ooh. Coins. When picking them up, I just realized we we're gonna use them. Was this okay? Sounds hmm? All right. I 
Alright, so this time I'm gonna kill him without making noise. There we go, we did it. <laughs> hey there. Shut up. Right, let's see if we can go up here. Cause... Uh... Yeah, hey. Listen here, pal. I'm sorry. Okay. You're not getting through. Yeah, bro, I'm totally different person. Boy, I just caught my hair right in front of you. Oh shit, body found. Get the fuck out of here. No. 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 Our, oh, there's one in top of us already. Let's go. Okay, wait. There's a keypad lock on the doors to the staff area. One moment. All right, try this. Four, seven, zero, six. Four, seven, zero, six. Okay. There's quite a bit of security here. One moment. Alright. You ready for some more fresh air, 47? I can't do this because it's gonna start everybody. I think I can open that window remotely. Scan the lock with your camera and I'll have a try. I need you to follow me. Are we clear? You know how rowdy some of get. Did I not make myself clear? Come here. Okay, um. Fucking save. Oh man, I should have saved. Uh, I already told you to follow me. What's the problem? Are you dim-witted, boy? I just follow. I knew you weren't really a troublemaker. Call it intuition. I'm gonna kill him in the corner. I have an excellent sense of character, and you seem very trustworthy, mister. Glad we're getting along so well. Good job, son. Just keep... No, no, I'm, I'm not transpassing. Hey, let's, you know what? Let's save. Because, uh, where you save? Um, empty save slot. So, okay, yeah. Join the meeting with Carl Ingram. Man, we gotta be this guy's the same. 
now have to go take that off their back. Drag body. Let's see. Um, Let's save real quick. So throw someone in there. Um, okay, where we have to go? is off limits. Leave now. Listen to me. Please help. There's something going on. Do me a favor and see what's up. All this guy walking around where he wasn't allowed. I just thought you should know. Calm down. I'll Man. Sir, you are trespassing. Follow me now. Understood? Hello, I don't mean to pry, but upstairs... Do That's you it. You're free to no go. Just there. don't come this way again. But here it's not just the Royal Highness. Sorry, I have no idea. You should talk to security. I just work down here. Well, I was just curious, but thanks for your time. Okay, where's my suspect up there? Looking good, man. Looking good. Any news on the new guard assigned a code name Pinky? I got word that he entered the building, but he hasn't reported. Probably down the table. I have to understand, you are not. I heard rumors. Always. Downward range. Oh, look at that. Sounds promising. No, it doesn't. Stuyvesant is expecting a replacement guard. If you can locate him. We should be able to get within strangling distance of the little worm. Um, F1. What's this? Thank you. 
What the heck am I supposed to do? Wait, do I supposed to have like one eye out? <laughs> Alright, let's go the others. Right in front of me. Right there. That's Marcus Stuyvesant, Providence partner. Alright, here to save. Guys, we're gonna be saving as much as we can. Self entitled and arrogant little worm. He might not look like much. Excuse me. But he's done more damage to the world than you could dream. Do you know how expensive this installation is? Everything has to be perfect or it has no purpose. Oh, here we go. If I would have shut up, I don't know how to take it down. Should have fought up fixed and call me when it's done. You still have the phone number I gave you, right? Or have you forgotten that as well? I tapped it into my speed dial. Good. It better be fixed when I come back. Singular. Here, bro, like the car is gonna like I mean, died. Come on, do something. Have a guard, have a good one. How are you, sir? Remember, your friends are. I hope you're talking with your 
daughter give you some closure. Alright guys, so like what the heck are we supposed to do? One favor, I will Shit. Cornelia's not long. Let to wait. Assistant to call yours. You know, I know a great little Hello place there, off the coast of the Philippines. You can only get there by private jet. God, what that irritating woman ever leave. I right, so I'm confused guy like is it so hard to kill someone or what? Alright, where is he? on my replacement guard? We know he has arrived. I'm sure he's just changing into his uniform. He'll be here very soon. Well, get back to me when he is reported for duty. And remember to check his papers first. I don't need to waste my time with some newbie. I expect the best. I'll call you as soon as he turns up. Good. And please, when I come back, no more excuses. I'm a personal friend of His Royal Highness, Omar El Ghazali. So, what is here? But I cannot go in there. Are you seeing this? Go see what it is. Go. No worries. Bingo. Wandering around here where you're not allowed. Can someone help me with this? Guy? Come on, switch on. We've got trouble. We got someone causing trouble. This guy's got a lot of dirt. Head back over there. I'll look into it. Hey, you. You are off limits. Sir, you will need to follow me. Please comply and come along. shoot the thing I think I should be able to kill him a self-entitled and arrogant little worm he might not look like much Ugh. but he's done more damage to the world Fuck, bro. Um. okay um. then you could dream I have to find Get over there. I can see the map. No meaning. I'm just 
understood. I've passed on your concerns, and I promise you someone is looking into it. That's what you keep saying. I just don't know how to call my hair. How hard can that be? Wow, I'm gonna get a structure. You can't be here. Please, leave huh? now. Got him, 47. Marcus Stuyvesant won't be a problem anymore. Let's move on to Carl Ingram. We're not done yet. <laughs> Let's save cars.
All right, hell no, I'm going to play. There has been. They're gonna hold me down. Fuck. Huh? Who's throwing things? Turn around, dude. to you sir This is going to make me look really bad. I'm sure it's around here somewhere. I told you once. A colleague is also out there looking. But this is awful. It's just so embarrassing. nothing I haven't seen before. But you don't Hey, wake up. I need you to get your shit together. It's over now. Fortunately, he got away. There's no way I'm passing.
Looking good today, sir. Looking good, man. Excuse me. You're not allowed here, you know. Do not move another muscle. Nice and easy. Hold it right there. Don't move. Put your hands up. He's engaged. Move it. Okay, there's a... Okay, I'm gonna spawn here. Because... Mister! You are currently trespassing in a restricted area. Hey, let's go. I'm not asking you again. Now follow me, okay? That's it. Run along now. Don't come this way again. There you go. Oh, Mr. Kazim. I'm glad you changed your mind. Arrogance can be a dangerous trait. Yes, indeed, it can. Mr. Ingram has been expecting you. We have a conference room set up for you. That was easy. I brought this in the beginning. Hello, sir. We're going to talk to her as we get up here. There's no way we're going to get up here without her. She doesn't... Yeah, yeah, girl, I I shaved my head. Go like in and make minutes, yourself comfortable. And I'm like, Mr. Ingram same person. Bye there. Thank you. The blade! Understand! The? Surrender the that weapon immediately! What? Nice. What? Let me see your hands. That's it. Drop whatever it is you're holding. Right now! Thank you, drop. Hey, hey! Drop the weapon! You hear? I don't usually give second warnings. Comply or die. Final warning! Hot shot! Six out! Engage! Engage yeah, your contact! Some, get some. What? Bro, you gotta be kidding me. Alright, which one was the one? This one, and let's go talk to lady again. Cause you are trespassing. That's it. One foot in front of the other. Oh. 
Oh, Mr. Kazim. I'm glad you died. changed your mind. Arrogance can be a dangerous trait. Yes, indeed, it can. Mr. Ingram has been expecting you. We have a conference room set up for you. How the heck am I killing with all those securities there, bro? Like, impossible. Greetings, sir. Please, go Sorry, in and sir. make yourself Seems comfortable. You're for this area. Mr. Ingram will be with Thank you, you shortly. Thank you. Wait, cause see where to do that. These are gonna be far. Oh, right, he's coming. Mr. Kazim, a pleasure to meet you. Omar tells me great things about you. I'll get straight to the point. I have a, well, let's call it a dispute, which the Royal Highness tells me you're very capable of taking care of. Now, I've worked with your organization before, in Morocco, I believe, so I'm a little hesitant. Don't be. We do what's needed. Well, only time will tell. I have two assignments for you. Take care of the first one, and then we can discuss the bigger fish. Now, on to the first. An acute problem has been brought to my attention. Keep talking. I'll be candid with you. No one is supposed to know that I'm here. However, there's a journalist down at the inauguration, and he's asking rather intrusive questions about who's staying up here, and that is a very dangerous problem for me. Now, I want you to silence this little pain. You think you can do that? It's what I do best. I like your bluntness. This is his file. Hans looked. Pulitzer winning freelance journalist. He's good. And won't give up until he gets the answers he needs. And that can't happen. Consider it done. Good man. And remember, I want a picture. I want proof so I can sleep tonight. Of course. Once this little assignment is completed, come back and talk to Miss Toe. Then we can discuss the real cancer that needs to be removed. I'm sure you can see yourself out. That's Carl Ingram, Providence Please partner. Huh, what happened? Brass balls billionaire. A legendary political fixer, Ingram is old money and as rotten as they come. You have no access here, sir. That's just the way it is. Accept it. Right, 
Sir, if you want to come through, I'm gonna have to pat you down. Please get out of my face. Hopefully they don't have to be in security. It seems Cornelia has a meeting plan with somebody on the R21. Number 47, Ingram wanted a photo of him eliminated. Now, personally, I don't care if he's just sleeping, but he needs to look dead. Mr. Look. I hear you're looking for information. Oh, really? Okay. You know what's happening upstairs? I know more than you could imagine. But we can't talk here. Follow me. Great. Lead the way. I can kill him, then nobody will suspect. Where are you taking me? Something big must be going on since you've taken so many precautions. I'm curious though, how do you know my name? I haven't told anyone who I was. Oh, well, I guess only time will tell. Reliable source that the Royal Highness Omar Al Ghazali is keeping a secret upstairs. Wait for me here. I'll be back as soon as possible. All right, whatever it is, better be good.
Yes, that's it. Now Ingram trusts you, it's like shooting fish in a barrel. Oh no. So tell me what your role was in this thing. Sorry, this I'm is a glad restricted we speak area. The same language. Sir, I will have to pat you down if you want to come through. Here it is. Nothing to report from my current location. Over. Just a quick pat down, sir. Nothing to worry about. Okay, let's go, sir. Thank you. Sir. Mr. Kazim, welcome back. So, you have the picture. Yes, here. Good. Our guest will be delighted. Please follow me. He's waiting. If you just follow me, Mr. Kazim. No need to panic. You have had time to see the art exhibition. His Royal Highness has a keen eye for the arts. So if you haven't yet, I highly recommend it. I apologize about the incident earlier downstairs, but you have to understand that we need to keep security tight, no matter who. All our guests go through the same procedure. I wonder how you take those things down. It's quite spectacular. On a clear day, you get a wonderful view of the Arabian desert. It's a sight to behold, the vastness of it. Back in China, this would never be possible because of all the smog. Mr. Ing. Mr. Cassie, so good to see you. Do you have the picture? Hey, man. Yes. Your problem is fixed. <laughs> Omar said you were good. Let's get down to the important business at hand. Okay, people, clear the room. I need to discuss some delicate business with Mr. Kazim. Perfect. Yeah. We have Ingram right where we want him. Excuse me for a second. 47, you know what to do. Have a drink, see the view. It's something to behold.
It's time to drop that thing in your hand. You got it? Take him down! Oh my god. Low from where, bro? I should have saved. I should have saved. I think it's this one. I think I should kill the other one and then kill him. Eye for the arts. Yes, yes. If you yes, haven't yes. yet, I highly recommend it. <sighs> Man, I got scared. I was like, no way. I apologize about the incident earlier downstairs. But you have to understand that we need to keep security tight, no matter who. All our guests go through the same procedure. Sure. Yes. Your problem is fixed. Huh. Omar said you were good. Let's get down to the important business at hand. Okay, people, clear the room. I need to discuss some delicate business with Mr. Kazim. Perfect. I'm sorry. We have Please Ingram right where we want him. Yeah, I just remembered something. 47, you know what to do. Have a drink, see the view. It's something to behold. choice in the matter. It's interesting we haven't come across each other before, Mr. Kazim. Well, maybe not. I usually have my people talk to people like you. I can imagine. I don't know how much Omar, I mean, the Royal Highness, has told you. But my guess is very little, so let me get straight to the point. My organization has been hit by an unpleasant cancer that can only be removed by cutting it out of the gut, if you get my drift. Yes, I do. Good. This little turd is spreading his vile, toxic cells, and I want him stopped. Brutally. Chemo won't remove him. Only the knife. How are you, sir? I have this file here. Arthur Edwards, a sly little devil, if there ever was one. Me and my associates, well, we underestimated the little worm. We want revenge. I think you and I share a common interest. I doubt that, but I want you to make him suffer. This is not a horse that needs to be put out of its misery. This is a rabid dog that needs to be put down. Am I making myself clear, Mr. Kazim? Yes. Consider it done. Good. We're now in business. We are. I'll have Miss Toe send you anything you need. We're done here. Oh, uh, one last question. I'm just curious. 
You're nicknamed the Vulture. Why? I find it's best to wait for the perfect kill. I think you'll be perfect for the job. Nice to meet you, Mr. Kazim. I look forward to receiving an update. Safe hunting. Back, bro. Um, start from again. There's something I need to do to kill him. Okay, people, clear the room. I need to discuss some delicate business with Mr. Kazim. Perfect. We have Ingram right where we want him. Please make yourself 47, you know what to do. Sir, your breath stinks. Back off. Now, where was I? Oh, that's right. My man here will stay for the meeting. I assume that will not be a problem. Either way, you have no choice. I can kill him. Okay, people, clear the room. I need to discuss some delicate business with Mr. Kazim. Perfect. Yeah. We have no, Ingram right thought. where we want him. Excuse me for a second. 47, you know what to do. Have a drink, see the view. It's something to behold. Carl Ingram finally gets what he deserves. Good riddance. Now let's get Marcus Stuyvesant. Mr. Kazem, you need to listen to me. Follow me and don't get sidetracked. Commercially successful. Here we go, we did it. Let's save. Let's save, guys, cause. All right, we we'll save. All right, guys. So I'm gonna leave it here. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for the support. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, liked it. Um, like I said, guys, I'm not the best on making this work news on hand, man. So it's gonna be a tough one. But bear with me, guys. Thank you for watching. I'll try to stay as much active as possible. Coming with those pictures of hand, man. So. If you guys enjoy it, just make sure to subscribe, guys, and hit that like button to keep supporting the channel, guys. Alright, guys, thank you. See you guys in the next one.